Hi, hello, ni hao. Josie here, and I'm so excited to actually shoot this video today because it's almost like a get to know tag. But this one I saw it on Facebook, and um, a friend shared the questions and the answered. So I thought, why not? Let me share the questions and answers with you guys. So first first things first yes subscribe down below if you haven't give this video a thumbs up if you like it at the end of it share with you with your people and uh, check the cards up here for for my previous videos my playlists chinese mandarin Tosi, and my general life so if you see any card card here click on it open in a new tab so that you watch it later or you can watch them and then you come and watch this good let's go the very first question is whom are you named after um i am not so sure because i was born to a single mom so if I was to be named, definitely it would be on my dad's side. But since we were not raised from that side, or we were just raised by our mom, I think the reason why I really don't know who I was named after. But I would really like to know who I was named after. Uh, mm, well, I'll ask. I'll ask them if they know. <laughs> Then, the second question, last time you cried, whoa, last time I cried, I think yesterday, after watching the doctors who were holding placards and staying, and saying stay home, we stay like something like stay home we stay here for you or something like that i think the messages were really touching yeah it was strange so yeah i cried yesterday do you like your handwriting there are times i do like my handwriting and there are times I write and I'm like, mm -hmm. who did this? I think for me it depends on the pen I use. <laughs> yes. And I don't write a lot nowadays, to be honest. So I guess my handwriting keeps getting worse and worse. The fourth one, what is your favorite lunch meat? I think we love goat in our house. We don't eat chicken that often and we rarely eat beef. Um, what other meats do people eat? Not the Chinese meats now. I mean the common meats that people eat. Comment your favorite lunch meat. Longest relationship. The one I have mean made right now. It's been. It's been. How many years? Eight years. Of love. Yes, it's raining. Hope it doesn't affect and hope I'm audible enough. Then. Do you still have your tonsils? Yes. I used to have tonsils, but they've never been removed. Would you bungee, would you bungee jump? I would. I think nowadays I'm open to adrenaline rush anywhere, anyhow. But there are some I wouldn't, I wouldn't try. 
<clears throat> what is your favorite kind of cereal? I love oatmeal. I think I think that is my favorite. Do you untie your shoes when you take them off? No. Unless it's really tight, but my shoes are never tight because I need that blood to circulate in my feet. Do you think you are strong-willed? I think so, but not all the time. Depends on the situations. Um, I think I'm really strong. Those people who know me, what do you think? Do you think I'm strong-willed? Favorite ice cream? Favorite ice cream? Mm. If you had asked me this question some months ago, I would say strawberry. But nowadays, I don't know ice cream anymore. You're wondering, right? Yeah, <laughs> I don't. The last time I had ice cream was last year, December. Yes. Let's hurry. Oh my, my battery is blinking. Uh huh. What is the first thing you notice about a person? Well, I'm always not really keen, but I would say. What do I notice in someone the very first thing? Probably the attire then, because that is what comes first. But okay, if we mean outside the, the appearance, apart from the appearance, then if there's something, someone, if they are some if they are someone I would have a conversation with or I would just not or just avoid them completely. For example, if you're approaching me and I see something in you that says no, don't engage in with this person in any communications, I won't. But Football or baseball? None. But I would do football if it was at gunpoint. Last thing you ate beans and rice. Beans. What are you listening to? At the moment, the sound of rain outside. <laughs> yes. If you are a crayon, what color would you be? I think I would be green. Like, you know, the green, green of those lands and the tree plantations. Not green. What is your favorite smell? The smell of burning garlic. Not burning like burnt, no, like frying garlic. Yes. Who was the last person you talked to on the phone? My husband. I was asking him to bring me this. Miss Mary, it's how married. I color black. Favorite food to eat? Fried spaghetti. Scary movies or happy endings? Happy endings all the time. Last movie you watched in a theater? I'm not a movie person, so. I don't think. Oh, apart from in China, there's a friend of mine who asked me to go watch with them a movie at the theater. But since then, Never been to a theater before and after that. 
What color shirt are you wearing? This one. It's not a shirt. <laughs> Baby blue? Or what do you call this color? Favorite holiday. I think I really don't have a favorite. All of them are just the same. I get to rest. Unless you're talking of in terms of it's the longest. Haha, <laughs> Easter. Hmm. Yep. Uh, beer or wine? Wine, definitely. Red sweets. Night all or morning person. Night all. Every freaking day. Favorite day of the week. How should be Friday? Do you have a pet? No. But if plants are considered pets, <laughs> where would you like to travel to? I want to go to Burundi and Rwanda at the moment. Those two countries. Favorite sports team? I think the Kenya Mal Malaika Malkia. Which are, oh, well, the volleyball team. <laughs> the Kenya females, women's volleyball team. Yes, those were 34 questions I just answered. And you've got to know me. Probably the sound was not so good. But if you like it or if you had everything, give this video a thumbs up. Thank you for watching. Come back next time for another one. See ya.